Sea Ray. Every moment perfectly crafted. Hi guys, it's me, Joey Sharp, Sea Ray Boats. Today I'm here to talk to you about Fusion Audio. I have Dan Suters with me from Fusion, and we're going to talk about some of the key features and benefits of Fusion Audio on Sea Ray Boats. Yeah, thanks, Joey. Um, I think today we're going to talk about some of the features that set Fusion yep. aside from uh, from the other brands out there, and, and probably why Sea uh, Ray chose us, but also how to actually use those features as well. So things like uh, digital signal processing, which we integrate into the stereos, uh, allows you to have the best quality audio out on the water. Uh, Built-in Wi-Fi on board our stereo systems allows you to use uh, technology like Apple AirPlay, AirPlay 2 for high quality streaming. Uh, we've got Fusion Link uh, integrations with the Simrad plotters on board, with the remotes and with the Fusion Link app on the phone as well. So there's loads of really cool features that set us aside. Um, so that's what we're going to have a look at today. So great, let's go take a look at this new technology. Now that we know the differences between Bluetooth and Apple AirPlay, how do we connect to each of those on the Fusion head unit? Sure. Um, it's actually very similar to the way that you connect to your Wi-Fi router at home. Uh, so the stereo itself has actually got a router built into it. On your device, you'll search for Wi-Fi connections, you'll find the device name, uh, click on that, and then you want to enter the password. In this one, we've, we've actually password protected the stereo uh, so that people that are walking by or in a boat next door can't just connect to your stereo and control your music. So you pop your password in, and then you Apple, open Apple Music, um, and you just select this device that you want to stream to. Uh, in this particular boat, we've actually got two stereos on board in two different areas. There's another one downstairs. Uh, and both of those can be on the same network. So from your device, you can choose which stereo that you want to pipe your music to, okay. um, or you can do both or just one individually, um, all through the same connection. So with that said, let's connect a device and see how it works. Okay, absolutely. So first we're going to uh, press the settings button here. And then I'm going to scroll down. I'm looking for network. Click on network. And then we can see we've got Wi-Fi off, Wi-Fi client, and Wi-Fi access point. Those are our three options. Uh, Wi-Fi access point is already selected, so we know that's correct. I'm just going to go into the advanced settings and just to check what the name of the network is uh, and what the password is. So I'm going to go into Wi-Fi access point settings. And here I can see the name of the, the network is MSRA770 with a bunch of numbers. We can rename that if we like. Uh, and then we've got a password of 12345678. Again, we can change that password. So now that we know what the name is and what the password is, we can connect on the phone. Okay. Um, so if you want, want to open up settings, okay. and then go into Wi-Fi, like you'd normally connect to a Wi-Fi connection, maybe at a hotel or at home, and we're going to search for devices. So it's looking now to see what's available. And there it is. And that's the one that we're looking for. So the name matches up with the SSID, which is the name of the network. Okay, so I and want to put in the password. Pop in your password there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Join. Okay, exactly the same process again that you'd normally expect at home or at a hotel. And we're connected. Okay. So. okay. so once we're connected, um, I'm going to close out of here so we're out of the settings menu. Now this is just back to the normal um, home screen. Okay. Um, I'm going to get you to just go into your Apple Music. So if you go back to your home screen, I think you've got music there. Yeah. Okay, so when you press play on this device, so you're playing some music, and here you've got a little button which tells, um, which allows you to select which devices you want to send the music to. So press on that one down the bottom. Okay. And there there's the RA770. So if you click connect to that, I'll just turn the, make sure the volume's down a bit. Okay, so now we're connected. Um, yep. We can actually see the music coming up on the screen here. We've got Hell's Bells by ACDC. If we turn it up a little bit, we'll be able to hear it coming through the stereo. <laughs> And again, in comparison to Bluetooth, we're actually getting that full width of that song now. So we're right. actually getting the high quality music through. So it's a little bit different to Bluetooth in that way. Sea Ray, every moment perfectly crafted.